So he's looking for that breakout. Drop off the pass, cut back inside. Got Hark up ahead. Drops it off once more, but Bird's under some pressure now from Sobchak. In close on Priest and goal for the Seahawks. Just like that. A little bit of quality. The bees take a little bit too much line to clear the run. A uh, little bit too much time to clear their own lines. Sobchak's going to rob a bird of the puck and just finds Chamberlain over there on the back door. Early pressure once again coming from the bees. Goodbye. Great bit of skating. Finds the back of the net. Bit of stunned silence here inside the Hull Ice Arena, but let's take a few more shots here. But still working it around this box the bees but maybe a chance in has found a way in With two seconds to go of the power play Paul make the bees pay and go back out in front in this one Ulrich here I think he looks to go across the spec I think it definitely takes deflection loops over the left shoulder of Griffin Priest Kelly can't quite bring it in and now Emil spec one on one with Griffin Priest. Finds the back of the net. For the second time tonight, the Seahawks take advantage of a defensive mistake by the Bees. And it puts them 3 1 to the good here on the record replay. Emil Svet, cool as you like, straight over glove side of Griffin Priest. Sobchak finds Barmer to his right. Nice bit of puck movement there. Speck finds Sobchak, but his shot's deflected. Wide left. Bartholomew doesn't take it with him, and he's rushing back. Potential breakaway here. Goes through to Antonov. Back to his right, back to Antonov. And a great bit of work. Got to say, composure by the Bees. To find the back of the net there that... Gotta say, you'll see it here on the uh, the record replay, but this is a great bit of work. Goes back across, everybody's expecting the shot, and he just sends it back to Vanya Antonov. Three goals to two here. And the few Beast fans who have made the journey I absolutely love that one. Here's Tom Barry. Looks to feed that through and just find Lee Bonner controls it well. Just looks to. Run a few seconds there, wait for the support to arrive. Salem feeds it through to Ulrich. Turns around, shoots, and it finds a way through. And I don't think it's got any deflection on the way through. I think it's just a matter of Griffin Priest is unsighted by the bodies in front of him. You'll see here, I think Nathan Salem and couldn't quite see who it was from the bees. Right in the eye line of Griffin Priest and Finley Ulrich. It'll be second of the evening. Pass for the bees into Ross Bottom. Quickly finds Balaz. The sob tracks going to dispossess. And find the loose puck. Now Svek, he's got Chamberlain inside. Finds Bobby Chamberlain. Finds the back of the net. And the whole record Seahawks stretch the lead to three. Great bit of play. Sob track found the loose puck. You'll see here on the record replay. On the blue line, found a mill spec. Simple pass across the ice, and as Griffin Priest is sliding from right to left, so, uh, so Bobby Chamberlain just goes the other way. And for the whole record, Seahawks second brace of the night. Bobby Chamberlain now on the two goals. Cross out on behind, and now Rose will send it round the boards. McLaughlin can't quite jam it where we would have wanted to. The follow move found Sveck. Great quick pass to Sobchak and the Bees man goes down. Keeps it moving, looking for Chamberlain and gets the hat trick. And the whole record Seahawks lead six goals to two. You see it in the record replay. Sobchak's trying to find Chamberlain and eventually threads it through. And Chamberlain just gets the redirect through Griffin Priest. Sixth goal for Hull, third goal for Chamberlain.